Shout out to my hometown of Edmonton. I miss you guys. Hello, it's Megan and welcome back to my channel. Today is an unexpected video. I would say it's kind of an impulse and buy, but I hope it lasts. I bought these wire cutters for another project. This will make sense in time, but that's not what this video is about. <laughs> so I went to Daiso and when you go to Daiso or any 100 yen store, you end up leaving with more than what you went in for. <laughs> you, you end up leaving with more than what you intended. Um, so this is my receipt. Um, I have the details kind of folded so I don't dox myself, but like, um, so these are the stickers that I purchased. Uh, rhinestone and pearl stickers. And I finally have uh, one of these tweezers that everybody on social media uses uh, for applying stickers. And it's nice to have so you don't have your fingerprints everywhere. And I have these stickers. They're holographic stickers. You won't find these in the sticker section. You'll actually find these in with a gift wrap. Uh, so I have those. But like the crown jewel of this video is this water bottle it is a daiso exclusive uh it's only 500 yen 550 yen after tax this was a special release for uh spring 2024 spring summer 2024 <coughs> um and it should say on there somewhere so you can maybe pause the video and check that out uh yeah so yeah, 2024, spring, summer. Yeah, um, but anyway, if you want to check it out, you can. Um, <clears throat> so it was a 500 yen purchase, so I figure, like, why not? And then I actually spent more on stickers and accessories than on the water bottle itself, which I think is amazing. Um, <clears throat> And the reason for that is because this is my current water bottle that I use on a daily basis. My students have described this water bottle as gucha gucha. And you can tell where I've been holding it too, right? <laughs> um, <clears throat> yeah, so it's a mess. Students have commented on it and it's not, it's not very aesthetic anymore, is it? It's functional, but it's not aesthetic. Um, so I'm thinking that this is eventually going to be like a new DIY project. I could see maybe sanding this down and, and giving it a repaint. I don't know. I'm going to have to research more about that and see what I can do. But uh, this is our current project. And then once you see the other video that I have planned, everything will just kind of come together. The stars were just meant to be. The stars aligned and like, oh my God. Um, I'm just gonna grab something real quick. Um, I had these for another project. These are scraps, but um, I have all the star fabric. So I could potentially make a case for this too. Like, I really, really appreciate that all this Y2K stuff is back in retail, and I have a teenage dream that I never had, <laughs> but um, let's not bump the camera. So yeah, um, I haven't decided what I'm going to do yet, but um, I don't know. Uh, there's so much potential. <laughs> so yeah, let's just get into it.
Okay, so I hope we're back. I was getting warnings on my phone that my storage was full and I had to back up some content and delete some videos and it was like a whole thing. But I hope that we're back in business. And here's the update for my travel mug. I have decorated it with my favorite band, Music Travel of Love, Moffitt's, and it's basically my teenage dream. <laughs> Um, so we're going to continue decorating, uh, maybe uh, put some bling there, do Zoomers and Gen Alpha, call it bling bling. I don't know what's the coolest lingo, but like, <laughs> yeah, um, I think my age is definitely showing in this video, but um, yeah, let's continue. Okay, so we are back. Hopefully we've resolved the storage issues, but this is my Y2K style coffee travel mug. I've blinked out the top of the mug off camera because I was experiencing the storage issues. But yeah, here it is. My music travel love Moffitt's coffee mug. The, I wanna call this the anti-Stanley cup. But, um, yeah, I hope to use these fabrics that I had from another project I didn't complete to make a case for my water bottle to hopefully avoid this situation that I discussed before. Um, but yeah, and then what I didn't talk about is these stickers were stickers that I already had from my collection. I purchased these at Loft, I'm not sure when. But um, yeah, they're like bling stickers. Do Zoomers or Gen Alpha say bling anymore? I don't know, maybe my age is showing, but yeah, yeah. Um, if you like this video, please like, subscribe, comment, and share. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.